Okay, so dug this trench here. It's about two two feet deep on average. Uh, just using my little three ton Kubota Japanese import one. Um, as I say, I'm quite impressed with the with the straightness of that for a beginner. Yeah. So the reason for digging the trench is I'm looking for a water pipe. So I've got a grass field down here that's got a water pipe going to it. Um, and obviously I've got my, my shed here that the water mains is at. Um, and my meter um, keeps going round and round. So it's meaning it's using water. And I've dug this trench trying to find the pipe. Um, so it comes basically from here somewhere, just at the corner here, comes right through and then heads heads across there and then into the field there. So I've dug this trench two feet deep, just checking for change in soil. Um, it's a gravelly sandy bottom here. Um, and as I say, I've stuck to that all the way to the end of the trench. Um, as you can see here, it's a great looking trench, ready for the ready for the wars if we ever need to get trenches dug again. So now as I say, we've dug this, trying to find the water pipe. Now I did doubt the farmer, I thought he would have taken the, well the farmer before me, I thought he would have maybe taken the easy route and just cut this corner off. Um, but I have found the water pipe up at the edge of the field, which would be the obvious place to put it. Um, so probably I doubted myself more than the farmer before, or I wouldn't have needed to dig that trench here. So, as I say, I found the pipe, but I don't know what's going on. I have got one pipe that was connected to here, and then I've got another pipe below that's obviously connected to there but there's no water coming out of them so the strange thing is I've got the water on at the moment so I know if I hit the pipe then I was just going to run back and shut the water off but the water is on at the trough because I was down there and checked that first so how can the water be on at the trough but it's not on here at the pipe and it's on at the farm so there's no Wi-Fi water as far as I can see there's no Bluetooth water it has to be connected with pipe yeah so if anyone has any suggestions on what to do, I'm going to maybe come back and dig that a bit deeper to see if there'd be a third pipe buried there, but the chances have been three pipes on top of one another and the bottom pipe being the one that's used, you would think if the old pipes on the top had been broken, they would have laid the new pipe and dug up the old pipe or laid the new pipe on top of the old pipe so that's my only other obvious thing that I can think of um, I haven't kinked the pipe in any way that it's stopping it, it's open I can get my finger in the end of it sorry I'm not getting on the camera I can get my finger in the end of the pipe and that one so yeah it's a strange one I'll get the wee um, what's it called? thumbnail get the thumbnail for the for the YouTube um, yeah I'll have to go back to the investigation part and find out why there's no water it's a strange one I'm beat I'm beat so no we'll go and get this digger back in the shed and uh, I'll have a think overnight I'll go and switch the water off and then I'll have a think overnight at what the reason is why we're not seeing any water Yep, can't quite get it. Can't get it, can't get it. Right, cheers.